We begin with a developing story, a major search happening right now for a missing boater near the Hallover Sandbar. Chopper 4 was over the scene where several agencies have teamed up in the search. Good afternoon, I'm Francis Wang. The call for help actually came in the middle of the night and investigators are still trying to figure out what happened. CBS 4's Joan Murray is live on Hallover with the latest on the search. Joan? Good afternoon. Francis, and this is a lot of manpower involved trying to find this missing man said to be in his 20s right off here, Hall Over Park. Now, you can see back there that there is a lot of activity going on in the water here. Um, we can tell you that Miami Dade Fire Rescue is involved. Miami-Dade Police, the Coast Guard, and FWC. Now, this all began overnight, about 2 in the morning. We are told that the Coast Guard got a distress call that a boat had been in an accident. Uh, when Coast Guard responded, they found two men in the water. Those two men were rescued. However, there was a third man on board the boat that was missing, and he is still missing at this hour. I spoke to Miami-Dade Fire Rescue a short time ago. They told me that they were were called to come in on the search about two in the morning. They assisted till about 4:30 in the morning, at which point uh, the search was called off. They said they were asked to come back about 8:30 this morning, and they have been out there ever since. So uh, the intense search resumed this morning when it was daylight. Uh, we can tell you at this point that there is not much known about the man who is still missing. Uh, all we have been told is he is a man in his 20s. Uh, this did, he disappeared about two in the morning and that the search is going to go on for the foreseeable future until they can get uh, a handle on maybe exactly what happened to him. So at this point, again, you have a number of agencies involved. We saw Coast Guard overhead, Coast Guard in the water. We saw Miami-Dade Fire Rescue, a boat in the water. Miami-Dade Police has a boat in the water as well as FWC. So this massive search continues for this man said to be in his 20s involved in this boating accident. We're not sure the circumstances. One theory is they may have hit a sandbar out there that caused all three to be ejected from the boat, but that has not been confirmed. Reporting live at Holover Park at this noon, Joan Murray, CBS 4 News. Joan, a lot of information there that we're just learning. Thank you so much for that live report.